While it's known that any extreme low calorie diet can lead to burnout, what happens when these diets are actually done the right way? If someone has a history of eating too much sugar or unhealthy processed foods, they may actually do well on this diet. This approach can actually help restore their metabolic flexibility, which will allow them to use fat for fuel again. And by cutting out all these carbs, it forces the body to start learning how to burn fat, which helps reset the insulin function. And insulin is a hormone that facilitates glucose transport into cells for energy but it also inhibits fat loss when it's constantly elevated. This insulin resistance is similar to the story of the boy who cried wolf because those constant high insulin levels from the high carb processed food meals and the frequent meals starts to desensitize the body's cells, which in turn makes them less responsive to the insulin's signaling because hormones should be released in small pulsed amounts to remain effective, especially insulin as this study shows. Because continuous high levels cause resistance, similar to how repeated exposure to things like pornography and those dirty websites and images that we both know you shouldn't be looking at can lead to things like dopamine resistance and a lack of a real life arousal. 